Hey, this is Morgan with Do Even Tech. Today in this video, we're going to be looking at a couple of Amazon Basic surge protectors. Uh, these are some really heavy duty, high jewel rating protectors, and uh, I just kind of want to show you what they look like. I don't know, uh, a lot of people don't really understand exactly maybe what a surge protector does, but it has a jewel rating and say, you know, lightning strike strikes your power lines or near your house and it creates a surge on on the lines going to your house well that creates a surge throughout your system and these surge protectors uh, hopefully the devices that are on the other side of them don't get damaged because the protector itself takes the hit so I mean you got to think of it this says 4500 joules and uh, it takes a 500 joule hit from a nearby lightning strike it has 4,000 left. A lot of people don't understand that that surge protectors actually wear out over time so it is something that you do have to replace um, every now and then and if your power is poor or has a lot of surges or things like that um, they can need to be replaced even more often than someone who maybe doesn't have quite as many power issues but <clears throat> this jewel rating is very important for picking out the right surge protector. Um, there's plenty of nice things about these Amazon Basics, not just the price, but looking at these devices, they are um, really nice looking and are compared to a lot of the higher end ones. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. It comes with a, a manual here, you know, nothing too crazy, your standard, uh, standard stuff on and off switch. How it works what's the maximum amount of power you can pull through it things like that so things that you do want to keep in mind when you're buying one but again the biggest thing that you're looking at is the the jewels of protection which is a very common misunderstanding it's not a buy a surge suppressor and never have to buy one again because it has that much protection that protection does uh, does wear out so I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in and turn it on. <clears throat> so, we should see here. <clears throat> In this particular outlet, it is a non grounded outlet. So, you see, only one half of this bar here is lit. If your outlet is grounded, both halves will be lit and it will be solid green. Um, all the way around this. This particular unit, um, all of them I believe that I've seen thus far, at least the two units that I have, um, both this 8 port and uh, a large one over here that I'll pull out in just a second and show you, both have the 4500 joules of protection, which is a lot. Again, is a lot of protection compared to some of the other ones, especially in this price range. They do have the uh, sliding outlet covers so that it keeps dust and stuff out of the um, outlets that are not being used and also keeps people from from sticking their hands or um, objects into the outlets near as easily or accidentally um, all except for the ground pin here so um, really nice these are spread out so that you can put you know larger what a lot of people call wall warts on these ports without taking up multiple slots which on these um, you're really only going to plug in a small plug like for a lamp or just a small grounded plug for um, some sort of electronics or phone charger into these ports here. These do not have any USB ports. Um, I'm sure that they've very recently released these and they will probably be releasing more and I would say that they would um, have some that has USB ports on it just because of the popularity of people charging devices like that. But Overall build quality and everything, it is very sturdy. It does have uh, mounting holes, so you could easily put it on a wall underneath a desk or something like that and be able to mount it with, with screws, though it does not come with any mounting hardware, just so you know. So you'll have to find a screw that fits it. Let me go ahead and show you this bigger version of it here. <clears throat> this is the 12-port uh, version here and um, 
it only has 4,320 joules, which is very close to the 4,500 that, that this one has, but um, falls just a little bit short as far as protection goes. Again, still almost double of what most of the other ones in the same price range uh, would actually offer you in protection. But as you can see, I mean, it's, it's about twice the size. This is a very standard size for an 11 or 12 port surge protector though. Has the mounting screws as well. Um, still no USB ports even on the larger one. But as far as something that's fairly inexpensive yet is going to last you longer due to its higher jewel rating than most of the competitors. So um, really good choice. This is Morgan McDeven Tech. I'll have some links in the description. We'll see you again in the next video.